there. But yeah, no one's in the student council room. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. Misha out of nowhere. Nice picture, though, actually. Yeah. Like it. it looks really nice. But yes. The short hair, though, the, the, and the pose kind of reminds me of Rin. Hmm. It does actually a bit remind... Yeah. <coughs> it is a bit Rinnish. Mm. Though, it's interesting we've run across Misha. Yeah. behind the school. Hmm. I wonder how this will go. But yeah, Hassel brings that up. It's hard to see. It's it's weird seeing her not completely bouncing off the walls. But he just leaves her alone. Hmm. Wonder if she noticed us. Hmm. 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 I... Okay. This is just all the firsts for this line. <laughs> yeah. I'm pretty sure we haven't had many of these since the couple that you always get in Act 1. Hmm. Yeah, and I have a feeling from what I'm reading, Shizune was pissed about the letter. Hmm. Yeah, from what I'm reading, Shizune may have, ta may have taken the letter very personally. Hmm. Come on, be proactive, Hassel. You were gonna do it just before. I think he's being proactive right now, which is nice. <laughs> Whether tissue boxes make good ballot boxes or not. I'd say, I'd say, Probably not, really. If there are um, anything like ch tissue boxes here in New Zealand, the whole see-through window in the top. Hmm. Well, it's one of those things you can easily cover up with a bit of paper or something. Yeah, yeah. but if you're going to do that, it may as well, you may as well just get a regular box. <laughs> I have a feeling we're not supposed to get drawn into this argument ourselves. No, we're probably not meant to be, but we straight up are. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, one, well, depends on what. Let's see what Shizune's suggestion is. <laughs> whilst whilst Misha's fucking cutting them up, I have a feeling that'd be a bit of a dick move. Though it's a very Shizune move. Exactly. Yeah, Misha agrees with us here. Though also, I agree with Misha. I do agree with it's Misha. So it's so weird. I like it as much as I preferred the twin drills. I like it, but then again, I'm it's, it's, team Misha it's, for the purposes of this line. It's not at all growing on me, and I don't think it will. I like it. I don't. <laughs> if you're talking about efficiency, given how many Misha's cut out, and given that you're implying here that you've printed them all out as well, you're not being efficient by changing the font size this late in the uh, juncture. <laughs> oh, really? What's this vote even for? <laughs> <laughs> that's uh, that's called embezzlement. That that's embezzlement. I'm assuming this is school funds. <laughs> oh wow. Yeah, yeah. You you are straight up embezzling school funds, isn't eh? You could get in trouble yeah. for this. <coughs> but hey. I doubt anyone cares, though. But yeah, Hisao... Uh, Hisao agrees here. An argument is a, is a constructive series of point in a constructive series of statements intended to establish a point. <laughs> it's not just saying no, it isn't. Yes, it's it is. rabbit hunting season. 
Uh, I, I was I was quoting Monty Python's argument sketch there for the poor souls. I'm, I'm well seen. aware of what you were quoting, but all no, that no, came, no, to just... me, came to me was it's rabbit hunting season, no duck hunting season, rabbit season, duck season. Yes, That's no, all I, I, I was, was thinking just, of just then. I was just going saying Monty Python for the sake of the, the viewers who hadn't seen it. I assumed you'd been aware. You were aware. Say again. I assumed you were aware of Monty Python, but there may be viewers who aren't. And if oh, you yeah. aren't, please, please remedy that. Yeah. <laughs> Def- yes. yes it is, yeah. Definitely go watch Monty Python. I am in a position where I should go back and rewatch them because it's been that long. Uh. My parents got to go see Monty Python live last year at the O2 Arena, but I was stuck down here at uni. I was so sad. That would be definitely a disappointment. But... Nothing much I could do about it, though. Mm. Anyway, where were we? (laughs) We were at a point where we were talking uh, about rabbit ducks, arguing yes, no, pads, memo pads. Um, Yeah. Interesting that they've taken this long to bring us into things, though. But then again, Shizane's not happy. Something's stressing Misha out. Yeah, and I have a feeling that that's something to do with us, personally. It's, how, it's something to do with the cell, that is. Hmm. And I can understand why Shizane's takes things seriously been president for three, three years and now I'm getting depressed about how her dad tra- 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 uh, treated how did her, how did her dad her? know she wanted to do this presumably he, she told him we know how great the thing is he didn't even realise she was deaf what? no he did he knew she was deaf Oh, she, he's quite clear, I believe he quite clearly states that for 12 years she just completely ignored me. I'm pretty sure that's a line that happened. I, I think what you're, what you're, the line you're paraphrasing is, for 12 years I had to, go to, had to go to all sorts of psychiatrists and therapists to try and make her normal. Which is no less infuriating to hear from her father, but I don't, I think he knew she was deaf. I don't know. I serious. I to be honest, for me, from that whole father, his view of things, I just honestly think he just thought he was she was ignoring him, mm-hmm. not Quite. actually realize and seeing death as an excuse. Yeah, I don't know. Anyway, know, that's that's how I'm. That's what I took from that. Perhaps we're seeing two sides of the same coin. Who knows? Maybe. <laughs> Will you even be at the school in order to be hard on them? I, I don't know. <laughs> and yeah, it doesn't sound threatening when Misha's saying it. Mm, no candidates yet. She looks oddly happy that I'm disagreeing with her. That's because she that's just because she wants an argument. Yeah. Uh, I'm sorry, sir, this is abuse. Arg- arguments is room 32B. More Monty Python there. Another classic the argument sketch. <laughs> yes, now she's just gonna go straight up and insult her successors. They're graduating in March. Northern Hemisphere school timetables are weird. It might just be Japanese timetables. Yeah, no, it's 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 just weird to us New Zealanders already. We we start school in January, late January, early February, and finish in mid December. Wow, our, our school years, and that's just because yeah. our summer is December, it, January, February. 
So that does actually line up nicely for us, but it's still weird when we hear discussions like, oh, things are in, school ends in like March and April. And it's just like, what? Like, it's just such a weird concept for us because, yeah. Hmm. But yes, Misha accidentally uh, insulted Shizune there. <laughs> yeah, she took that a little harder than Misha may have intended. Then again, knowing Misha, there's there's no way she would have intentionally insulted the thing is, Shizune. There's a like lot that. of things we think about Misha. Yeah, that's probably that's quite possible there. Yeah. Perhaps because, and Hassel pointed out earlier that this was the first time he'd seen them arguing, so perhaps their relationship isn't as smooth as it seems. And, you know... Us. Hassel. Yeah. We're probably the fault of the situation. Yeah, if there is a situation between them, it hey, is probably going to be our fault. again, he did make that one comment to Misha. Yes. For those who don't remember, he, uh, he basically said to Misha... We like, we, or I like you, more or less. I like and you. Misha, and on you're, the surface, I think it was. To the, I think he pretty. I think he said, "You're the only one I'd like to her." After doing, after mimicking her whole sneak up behind and cover the eyes thing. I don't know. I don't think it was that. I just think it was something along the lines of, "I like you." And whilst on the surface, Misha was, "Don't be silly. You clearly like Shizune." I have a feeling she may have taken that more, more. More deeply into more deeply than we might we might think. Mm. <laughs> They're making their move now. They don't deserve a vote. <laughs> I think that's just you, isn't it? That, this is just you. But then again, is this Misha? I think this is Misha, not Shizune. Uh, only the bad ones for some reason. But yes, speaking of elections being absurdly early, what the fuck is America doing? Having Amer election campaigns for the 2016 election in 2015. And on that subject, um, Donald Trump can fuck right off. That's, I don't know, that's just something they seem to do. New Amer Zealand's bad enough, given that as soon as we hit the six-month mark... That's all it is for the next six months. Yeah, I think England do it pro do it well. Like, there is a specific window six months out where you're allowed to campaign, and there are very specific rules about what you're allowed to uh, campaign about and how you're allowed to treat other, other candidates. I do think they do it well. And, you know, political adverts have to have a statement beforehand saying, this advert is brought to you by the party that is paying for this advert. And at which point, 90% of the British public just tune out. But yes, more countries could take a uh, take an example for uh, from Britain in terms of campaigning law. But even then, this is an interesting point where he's bringing, where he's now thinking that, you know, did she actually get elected to the position? Mm. Or but did she get just... recruited into it and, and by process of elimination end up leader? Hmm. Wouldn't surprise us. Wouldn't surprise me either, Hassel. Yeah, it would be pretty bloody sad. Well done, Hassel. <laughs> hmm. If, were, if ballot boxes were funny looking, I'd sure as hell take one. <coughs> No, I like I like his sales idea. <laughs> the little picture shows an A and B trying saying stealing is wrong. Yes. Uh, voter turnout. Oh, far out. I'm for those who uh, 
our interest, I don't know. But recently my university had student elections and our university has the highest voter turnout in New Zealand uh, at 33%. And one of the candidates that went to, to run for uh, the president of the uh, student union was a crane. The, uh, unfortunately, the election was uh, considered null and void as due to extenuating circumstances that I'm not entirely sure about. And I was really, I was really disappointed because I didn't get to vote for the crane as, as president of the uh, student association. That's disappointing. But then again, that reflects New Zealand's actual prime minister voting. Where I think in the last couple of elections, we've had two comedians and their chili bin full of beer and a pineapple. <laughs> yeah, and we are the home of the McGillicuddy Serious Party, which yeah. almost had a, he- a hedgehog elected into a into a city council. Well, we got we had two comedians and their chili bin full of beer reach the there's a threshold ben. that are uh, to become a party for New Zealand politics. You need to put down a some money on it, and it's a few thousand dollars. It's so a few thousand dollars, and you get yourself officiated or something or other, yeah, and you, you have a party, political party, which you have, which can be voted for at the. Um, elections yeah. and, and because New Zealand works on MMP which if you don't know what that is go go search CGP Grey MMP electoral system and learn all about the wonders of the best electoral system in the world yeah and pretty much if you get a certain percentage of votes you get that bond back you get that bond back two comedians in a chili bin did that and then went and had a piss up <laughs> yeah <laughs> <laughs> Uh, that's that's one thing I love about at least uni, uni life in particular is just how laid back everyone is. No one really gives a shit. And everyone 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 I know wanted to vote for the crane as well, mm. just because just because it would have been a funny thing to have happen. But anyway, back to this student election. <laughs> hmm. And Misha is watching the mood again, and Shizune is miserable, but, or annoyed at least. Mm. Well, that's, this is reassuring to hear. She actually has students interested, and she's do- that's why she's doing the work. Wow. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> <laughs> they can buy their own celebration dinner. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, but interesting, she's basically saying she'll be happy once she's done with the student council. Well, it does seem to be an incredibly thankless job. Yeah. It's like a little party. Hmm. Knowing this game, I don't know if that party will go all that well. Hmm. No, given the only other party given this we've game's been involved track record. with... Yeah, the um, only other party, party that... that we've been involved with turned out lovely. 